I'm a seismologist, I work in Strasbourg and uh, before studying seismology I studied uh, physics and astrophysics and then I had a PhD in seismology all this at Cambridge. And then I went to Strasbourg the first time for a postdoctoral study, uh, then to uh, California for another two years and then I got my position in Strasbourg. So geophysics is a branch of geosciences and all geosciences try to study the earth the Earth is something we cannot see. Most of the Earth is under our feet. So we use methods mostly from physics to actually see what's happening underground. Before you build a building, you need to know what kind of rock is there. Before you dig a tunnel, you need to know what kind of rock is there. So this program enables students to be able to work in any of these fields. Many companies who uh, need to know what's happening in the subsurface to be able to do their job. You have petrol companies, uh, you also have all the companies that uh, do the services for these countries, companies. So all the companies that will do the exploration, all the companies that will uh, look at what the soil is like where the uh, an extraction company wants to build a platform. Then you have all the companies who are looking for water, all the companies who are looking for ores, so all the mining companies, and then you have uh, all the geothermal companies. So one thing the students here do that the students uh, where I come from do a lot less is ask questions. So what I'm really taking home is that this is so important uh, and to try and make you know, get my students to also ask questions. One, another thing the students do here is if I give material, they will read it before the class and then come to the class and we can then talk about the material. So this is like an inverse class, and it's something that has existed for a long time in the United States and in France it doesn't really work so well but here it's fantastic. They very often ask about careers and I think this is very, um, uh, it's very good for them and it's very good for me because it helps me when I teach put into what I, what I teach, explain why it will be useful uh, in the future for their careers. I take advantage of, this, of the teachers who are here when they are here. If they give the material, read the material in advance and ask all the questions that they have. Prepare before the class, it's be very present during the class, ask the questions during the class, Ask the questions when the teacher is doing problem sets uh, and then keep working on the problems. Trying and, th and think what is, what is the really important thing, what, what is the image I have to keep in my brain to really understand what is happening. And when they understand, everything is easy.